Russian soldiers fighting in Avdiivka seek a way out as prisoners. Near Avdiivka, each day, a new swathe of Russian soldiers crawls towards Ukrainian positions through the muddy fields already strewn with the bodies of their compatriots, according to Kyiv Post media outlet. It is noted that, meanwhile, Russian artillery is diligently wiping the city off the face of the earth. While more than a thousand residents are still living in the basement of their apartment blocks, the population of Avdiivka shrunk recently when 100 people finally agreed to evacuate. They were taken to the rear by Ukrainian police. The police recently performed another special mission in the area together with the volunteers from a Kharkiv animal rescue organization. In the spring, the Russians bombed a stud farm in the suburbs of Avdiivka, killing about 300 horses. Two of them escaped alive and ran into town where they had been living among the ruins, traumatized and frightened of people. A new batch of Russian prisoners of war is also waiting to be sent away from Avdiivka. They are easier to transport than horses, but first, those who are wounded undergo a series of interrogations to determine whether that soldier has committed any war crimes. After the verification process, a long journey of several days awaits the prisoners. It usually ends in Western Ukraine at the only functioning prisoner of war camp Zapad 1, where some commentators say life is a little too comfortable.